I was recently asked by a friend to identify a succulent that produced what they described as a yellow Christmas tree shaped flower. Yeah, good description. This is an aeonium. Hard to say, but easy to grow. These are super tough water smart plants. The fleshy leaves form an attractive rosette. The flower spike is produced on mature bushes and is filled with a mass of small daisy shaped blooms. If you're into dramatic effects, then how about trying this darker leaf variety? We've recently heard from a number of concerned Garden Guru Club members. They've purchased a range of click-on spray products, but due to various water restrictions, can't use the hose in the garden. Can we help? Yes, we can. Each of these packs is a concentrate that needs to be diluted before being applied. This is done by clicking it onto a hose. However, if you turn the container around and check the back, you'll see the directions for manually mixing these contents. In this case, it's 300 millilitres of concentrate to nine litres of water. Add this to a watering can, and you can now apply the spray, albeit a little bit differently, any time you like. Here's a question from Sam at My Ponga. How do you know when a plant needs repotting? Well, generally the plant will tell you. It doesn't have any new growth, very dull foliage, and sometimes there's a bit of dieback. But the real test is when you take it out of the pot. If the plant is seriously root bound, it's time for action. Grab a serrated knife from the chopping board and cut through, removing the bottom two to three centimetres of the thickened root ball. Then tease out the new base. Plants in smaller pots are likely to need repotting more often. Now when choosing a pot, try to go up a couple of sizes. In this case we started with a 150ml pot, we're going to ignore the 200, instead we're going to go for a 250mm pot to get the plant into. Using a premium potting mix, put in the plant and backfill. Water in using a seaweed extract to really get this tired specimen up and growing. Well that sorted that out. Now, if you've got the questions, we've got the answers. It's easy to join our Garden Gurus online club. Simply jump onto the web and type in the gardengurus.tv.